Alright guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to compress your selfie video because if you make it on your phone it could be rather large and it could take more time to attach, uh, especially when you're trying to send it to multiple people. So this video is a, uh, a quick home walkthrough, not really the whole house, but just an invitation saying, hey, this home's hitting the market, just thought you may be interested. If you are, let me know and I'll tell you more about it. So we're going to run an ad for that, but we're also using it for a follow-up video because might as well. So I'm going to show you how to compress it and cut the file size in half so that we can send it faster uh, and effectively from the desktop versus our phone. So we go over here to Google and we search compress mp4 and I always go with the first one that's free convert. So we'll open that up and it's easy as choose your files. So you can see this is my file. You can see that the file size is 17 megabytes. So our goal is to cut that in half. You can see the duration is just a little bit over a minute, which is cool. So we're going to try to cut that in half. So we can click this little gear here and we can go for 50% the size. Apply. And then we want to click compress. And that will take just a few moments to compress and then download and we'll be ready to send that out in bulk and the reason you want to do this once again is the smaller the file size the faster it's going to attach so when you're doing this with hundreds of messages it's going to save you at least 30 minutes right and I'm all about saving time so I, I look at every way to improve that so I wanted to share that with you here If you're doing it from your phone, it attaches, um, you know, relatively quick. But at the same time, I've just found it faster and more efficient to go ahead and send the video to my computer, compress it, and then do it through the desktop or have someone else do it. So you can see this one's almost compressed. We're going to cut that file size in half. It means we're going to cut our upload time in half. And we're going to save some time and reach more people and hopefully start more conversations and sell more homes. That's the goal, right? So we'll click download. And you can see now the file size is 8.4 megabytes. So now we'll just go over here. Uh, this one says not at the present time, so it wouldn't make sense to send it to her. This one was a non-responder, so we'll just go ahead and attach it. Just like so, you'll just wait a second, you'll see this thing spinning, and once it gets done, it looks like an attachment, and then you can just send it. And then I'm just going to repeat it over and over and over, but I wanted to walk you through the process to make sure that I've done my duty to save you some time, because we only got so much time, and if you're not doing your follow-up, show the person that is doing your follow-up this video. This will be super helpful for them. Please go ahead and like this video and comment on the video. That way more people in our group can see the video because that's, that's just the way Facebook works. You know how that works. So if you would, do me a favor, go ahead and engage on the video so others can see it. So I'm going to send this over and there we go. So I'm going to continue to send it to the next pretty much everybody in the inbox because I, I try to keep a clean inbox and I'm helping Adam out here today so just wanted to show y'all how to do that I hope y'all have an awesome day